we're going to do an underwater theme using uh, bubble wrap. So our first thing that we need to do is we need to draw our underwater theme. Okay, so I'm going to just quickly do a nice quick underwater theme. What do we have underwater? We've got octopus. Okay, so Jade's got a book and it's called Ollie the Octopus. So we're going to have a yellow octopus. Right, and how many legs does an octopus have? Eight, that's right. So we're going to draw one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight legs. Right, and we're going to colour our octopus in. Okay, what else do we get under the water? First of all, our octopus needs some eyes. Don't you think? There we are. Okay. Oh, and that's right. Yes, we need a mouth. Okay, what else do we have under the water? Yes, fish. So, should we do some orange ones? Okay, so it's very easy to draw a nice fish. We're going to go round, do a circle, okay, and then a triangle. Okay, that's our one fish. Should we do that again? Okay, we're going to do a circle and a triangle. And there's our next fish. Okay. Two fish alone is very lonely. Fish swim in very big groups. So we're going to do a few more fish, a circle and a triangle. Okay, then yes, we have seaweed. Okay, grass under the sea that the fish eat. Okay. Now you can even use this with your hand prints using your paint like you did your mermaid. And you can make octopus, you can make fish using your hand prints. Okay, and you're going to do a whole underwater theme. Right, we're going to have a crab. Then what we're going to do is we're going to take our blue paint and we're going to mix a little dot of blue paint with a lot of water. Okay, and we're going to paint it. But when fish swim and when we're under the water, what do we see? We see bubbles. So we're going to make some bubbles underwater. So here we take our bubble wrap, okay, and we're going to take our blue paint with no water, plain blue paint, okay, and we're going to paint the bubble wrap. Right, now we're going to use it to stamp. Okay. And we put it down, and we tap it lightly, and we lift it up, and we've got bubbles. And there's our bubbles. And we can do this all over the page. Because your crayons will still show through. 